Hey guys, this is Candle, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Yes, uh, we have finished the main game. However, we are not finished with the game at all. We still have a few things to do. For one, we still have to explore, uh, whatchamacallit, the uh, uh, World War One thing. I still have no idea what's going on with that. And for another, we now have four missions available from Queen Victoria herself. So we have to go take care of that. I think we'll probably do those first. Now, surprisingly, the credits have not rolled yet. The credits always roll after uh, after the main story is completed, and yet they haven't. I don't know what's going on with that. I, it's it's new. It's different for this game. For these games, uh, we're gonna go ahead and kill one of the guards here, just so, just so we don't have to worry about him. But what we want is to keep uh, going south, pretty much. Uh, we need to go start the first Queen Victoria mission, of which there are four. And that one is right up over this way. That's where it starts. Hopefully they won't take too long. I would like to be done with this game in the next two hours, and then we will either move on to Assassin's Creed Rogue, or, uh, depending on uh, whether or not there's DLC available yet, I will get that. Anyway, stop a new Templar faction from bringing dynamite into London. Okay, Operation Dynamite Boat, suggested level 10. So yeah, we have completed the game, but there's still more to be done. Now, the only reason why I'm doing these missions is because they still have, like, story-based stuff. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't worry about them. I still have no idea what's going on with World War I, though. We're, we still have to check that out. But, to get this started... Majesty. We understand that with Crawford Starrick gone, a certain secret society finds itself searching for leadership. An upstart faction seeks to enter London and seize power. Do you feel your life is in danger, ma'am? No. Rather, I fear that the people of this grand city may suffer. I call upon you to foil this traitorous plot. You can depend on us. You will meet my loyal aid at the docks for instructions. The work begins immediately. In other words, leave now. Get out. Get out of my house. You're no longer welcome here, at least for the time being. But no, yeah, we've been charged with new stuff by Queen Victoria herself. <sighs> okay, just gotta wait for the game to load. You know, that is one thing I will not miss once I'm done with this game is the Fucking long loading screens. Speak to Fleming. Fleming who? Alexander Fleming? Why does that name sound familiar? Uh, I want to say it's somebody famous, but I don't know. I don't know why or correctly who, but we're, we're going to find out. I wonder if this is another famous person or if it's just a fictional person. They just chose the name Fleming. That's why the name sounds familiar. Ian Fleming. Ian Fleming wrote the James Bond books. Okay. Yeah, Sir Ian Fleming, I believe, actually. But no. I am Alfred Fleming. I run Her Majesty's Secret Service. Oh, of course you do. First things first, we need to clear the area of anything that might alarm the enemy. Like that police carriage. Would you kindly dispose of it? So it's no wonder that they decided to uh, name this character Alfred Fleming, considering... Ian Fleming, who wrote uh, the James Bond novels, I believe also may have served in Her Majesty's Secret Service. I could be wrong, though. But I don't think I am. Anyways, that is done, and let us continue on, then. Had to, uh, blah, 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 blah. Started, got tongue-tied there. We have to head back to Fleming now. Okay. Hopefully these missions won't take too long. But what, oh, what are we doing here? Up and over. Well, Fleming. Now, my agents are here disguised as civilians. Get them into position for our ambush. Why do I have to do this? The ship will soon arrive from Boston. Its cargo, dynamite. Its crew, Templar. Okay. What say you to greeting it with an ambush? If we must. We must. Okay. It says defend the area. Let's see. Apparently, 
I'm supposed to reach a vantage point. Okay. Well, up we go then. I don't know where the vantage point is, but we will find out. Templar ship arrives soon. I don't know what is going on here, what that timer's counting down for. I don't see a vantage point anywhere. It told me to reach a vantage point. I didn't see one anywhere. And now we've got a black screen while the music keeps playing. There we go. Okay, so the boat is here. The Templars are here. What do we do next? Well, Mr. Fleming? Ah. Kill the Templars. Defend the area. Air assassinate from a crane. Well, all right then. If I can. There we go. We're on the crane. Now. There we go. Air assassinate. And that is done. There we go. Ah. Okay. There we go. Gotcha. Ooh. Come on. Come on. There we go. Gotcha. Good. Take two of them out real quick. All right. Come on. Come on. There we go. Not doing too bad. All right. Now, last one, I believe. And he's dead, so what's next? Now we've got to reach Fleming again, okay. What's next, Mr. Fleming? What is next? Alright then, so let's go tackle him. Oh, of course this is going to be one of those tackle missions where, uh, they can actually run at full speed to the point where it is really hard to keep up with them. Great. Just awesome. Okay. Come here, you. There he is. No! He triggered... Yeah. I ran right into that. Should have run past it. What? What? Uh, let's go back this way. Aha. Okay. Not quite the way I wanted it to go. Come on, through there we go. Okay, it's going to take me a little while to catch up. Come on. I don't need to take every twist and turn. There he is. He runs again. Aha! Gotcha! Thank you, crossing thingamabob. Would you care to tell me your plans? Go to hell! Now, now. Steric may be dead and gone, but the Templar Order will never die. We will rise again, like a phoenix from the ashes, and bring the world to its knees. Yes, well, best of luck with that. Uh-huh. Okay. Let's deliver him. Let's deliver the Templar leader. There we go. Shove him in. And now we have to actually properly deliver him. Or, maybe not. My people are recovering their explosive cargo. You did fine work today. I will have a chat with our distinguished guest here to see what schemes he and his friends are brewing. Do let me know if he says anything interesting. Yes, anything. Alright, so that is the end of the first Queen Victoria memory. Operation Dynamite Boat is a success. Okay, so where's next? We have to go back? We do, don't we? Yeah, we have to go back in order to get the next mission. From the good old Queenie. Okay. Well then, let us carry on. Just gotta wait for it to load. Three more of these missions and World War I. Three of these missions plus World War I. And then we should be able to call it quits. Until, or unless, more DLC is available. Now, by the time you guys view this, it very well may be that uh, there is DLC available, in which case, I'll go ahead and play it. Uh, if not, then we'll have to wait, and I will play Assassin's Creed Rogue instead. So, we shall see what happens. Okay, down we go. I am just so glad, now that we are sirs and dames, 
that Buckingham Palace is no longer a restricted area. That is, I think, is awesome. Okay, but the question is... Where is the good old queen? The jolly old queen. Somewhere to the south, I wanted to say. On the other side, for sure. On the other side of the palace. A very imposing structure. Not exactly what I would call beautiful architecture, but it is very fine looking still. Plus, there's uh, it's very grand and large. But I've always been more partial to uh, Victorian architecture, Gothic architecture, Baroque, stuff that is very intricate, and so on. And I think I've gone too far south. There we go. I need to head north-ish along here somewhere. Where should it be? Yeah, okay. Uh, we're gonna probably... We may have to head inside the palace. Yeah, we gotta head inside. So, if you won't, don't mind, let me through. Thank you. Okay, screw it. Thank you. Now get out of my way. Out of my way. There we go. Now I can get through. And head upstairs. Ooh, wait a second. We're inside the palace, isn't there? Oh, it's on the other side. Okay. It's too far away. I was gonna say, isn't there a letter here? But we're we're already, like, right where the queen is. It's It's too far away to really worry about, so... We're just going to continue on then. There we go. Talk to the good old queen. Operation Locomotive. Stop the Templars from sending a train full of dynamite into a crowded station. Mr. Fleming has attempted to force a confession from your prisoner. The miscreant refuses to talk. Will you speak to the villain and learn his secrets? All right. Leave it to me, your majesty. Unfortunately, he's a good deal away. Is it showing our map where he is? Uh, yes, over here, okay. Well then, let us get back outside of the palace. Shall we? Oh, we can't jump that, damn it. Yeah, let's get back up outside of the palace so that we can continue on. Hmm, odd. Uh, just kind of thinking to myself there. I thought it was kind of odd that the railing was inside the stairs, rather than on the walls or whatnot. Anyways, why am I going this direction? I don't want to go this direction. I want to go this direction, I think. I think this will get me closer to the uh, outside sooner. Hey, the, his head's still there, but he is gone. Yes, actually, I am in a hurry. I am trying to escape the palace and go... Fight the Templar leader. Yeah, I gotta, gotta go punch the living daylights out of him in order to get what we need. Get the information we need and so on. Something about a locomotive filled with dynamite rushing towards a, uh, a full station. A crowded station. Okay, it's not too far away, I don't think. Only about 130 meters, not even. There we go, up and over. Okay, right over this way. We are almost there, actually. Ooh, damn horse. Get out of my fucking way, horse. There we go. Thank you. Okay, right here we are. And right here we go. We've got to get inside and up top. Yeah, Scotland Yard, I guess. All right, up we go, because he's in the hold-up, or the lock-up, which is all the way on the roof. Well, not the roof, it's in the attic. Why it's in the attic, I don't know, but that's where it is. There we go. All right. There we go. Yeah, just keep pummeling him. Might as well. The order was to load a train with explosives at Westminster. It'll detonate before reaching Southwark Station and kill everyone aboard. You people in your damn dynamite. Do anything, anything when does it want, happen? It's the next train. It should leave at any moment. You'll okay. We'll see about that. Up we go. Already so close to the top of the building. Okay, across we go. Probably the best way. Yeah. 
We've got to get to the train. I assume that's what the timer's for, is to get to the train before it leaves. Or it could be about... Well, no, the train doesn't seem to be moving. Our goal doesn't seem to be moving, so... Yeah, we, we must have to get to the train before it leaves. But isn't, isn't that the station there? I don't know. Oh, I guess the train is moving. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> the train already left the station. We don't, that's the time limit to defuse the bomb. Ah, no, 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 no. Don't, 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 don't. Ah, fuck. Come on, come on. Evie, run. Run, 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 run. Just gotta catch up to the train. Get in, get on the train, get on the train. There we go. Okay. Through we go. Gotta get all the way up front. There we go. He's not a problem. Neither is this one. Or this one. There we go. And just keep moving. Alright. Good. Not a problem. Keep moving. We only have so much time. Okay. Alright. Good. More than half a minute to spare. There's the bomb. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Uh, here's a problem. Oh, okay, there we go. I was gonna say, wasn't the bomb intended to go off in the next station? But apparently not. There we go. Well, that's the end of that one. Alright. And. We have 10,000 gold now, or 10,000 pounds. That should be enough to upgrade one of our inventory things, or is there something we can craft? Uh, well, there's plenty of stuff to craft, but nothing that we can actually do right now. So let's go back our capes. Yeah, we, uh, I forgot to show this, but we can now craft the Aegis Cloak, which is inspired by Minerva's famed battle attire. Uh, may not be a precursor artifact, but it's still one of the finest cloaks one could possess. And it has the same stats as the royal cloak. So that was the one that was still hidden from us. But I think we'll stick with the cloak of victory. I don't, considering it has the same stats as everything else right now when it's leveled up. Uh, we would have to upgrade these in order to make them better. But I, I might at, uh, go to the royal cloak if we get that, but I don't know how to get that. Uh, firearms. Yeah, that's upgraded. Assassin Gauntlet's upgraded. Weapons are not upgraded. Okay. Uh, outfits. The one we're wearing is upgraded, so I don't have to worry about that. That just leaves, yeah, the weapons. Now, I still don't know what's going on with this one. It has to be crafted, but it's a secret item. I have no idea about it. Yeah, no idea. I have to uh, progress through the game to discover more about the schematic, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do to actually do that. So, my choices are... Uh, you know what? We'll just go ahead and upgrade the legendary assassin Kukri. There we go. There we go. That takes all of our money. And now the only thing it's lacking on on the Dove Cane Sword is the stun, but that's okay. And the next thing we'll probably do is upgrade the Eagle Splendor Knuckles, because that's what uh, Jacob's is using. Okay, so I assume... Wait, where are we? Yeah, okay, so we're here, and the next Victoria mission is over this way still, back in Westminster. Operation Drive for Lives. Yes, it is the second to last Victoria mission. It's the third one, so it's the second to last. These really aren't taking all that long. I'm kind of glad about that, because I am tired of this game. It's been, what, 32 hours now at this point, I, th I think? Let's see, this is set 17, so yeah, it's been 32 hours. Considering all my sets but two were two-hour recording sessions, uh, one of them, the very first one was one hour, and another one was three hours, so they even out. So it's, yeah, 32 hours into this game. Damn, this is by far the longest Let's Play I've ever done. Not in terms of numbers of videos, but in terms of uh, actual hours, yeah. Because the only ones uh, longer, or the, the longest ones in terms of videos are, uh, I want to say, Kingdom Hearts, um, uh, Assassin's, yeah, Assassin's Creed 3, I want to say it was. 
and uh, whatchamacallit, uh, oh, what was the other one? Tomb Raider 2. And each of those were somewhere around 100 videos, which means they were around 24 hour, 25 hours long. Maybe a little bit past. There we go. Civilian defended. And what we want is way to the southwest here. As a matter of fact, I think I'm going to take this carriage. Come on. There we go. Turn this around. And there we go. Okay. Just to speed things along a little bit. But then again, <clears throat> this is one of the... Out of all those longer games, this is the only one I've played blind. If I knew what I was doing, where to go, what was important, and so on, I might have uh, made shorter work of this game. Let's turn this way. And we'll go through here. There we go. Okay, how far? Oh, duh. It's supposed to be just to the north here. There it is, actually. Come on. Up, Eevee. Get up, get up, get up. Up and over the fence. Thank you. Okay, so there's the queen. We have to become anonymous to continue. The queen's out walking around. Oh, my best chance to become anonymous, anonymous is actually to kill all of the guards. And of course, if this were real life, the queen would be rushed off right now. Ow, come on. There we go. Okay, one last one. Should be the last one. Apparently not. There are more coming. Plenty more. Okay. I think this is the last one, though. Gotcha. Damn it! Where the hell did you come from? There are more. What the fuck? Where the hell did you all of you come from? Okay. That's still not the last one. What the fuck? Seriously, what the fuck? Okay, come on. You're supposed to be using the gun, but whatever. Oh, come on, come on. Down we go. Alright. There we go. Now he's done for. And now we should be anonymous. Now, where are you, Queenie? Over this way. How the hell are we not anonymous? Nothing's going on. There we go. Now, Operation Drive for Lives. Track down the escape leader of the upstart Templars. Our much lamented husband adored these gardens. He called them his one safe port in the midst of the mad seas of this world. We miss him dearly. But never mind all that. To business. Our Mr. Fleming has learned from the Templar prisoner that an attack is imminent. But before we could learn more, he escaped custody. He is believed to be hiding in Westminster. Recapture him for us, that we might learn his secrets. Yes, and of course... Be brief and long, ma'am. I promise. Of course she is using the royal we where basically she just means her, but she's speaking of herself, the crown, the throne, and the country. That is why it is always a royal we. Because she's not just speaking for herself, she is speaking for her country. Okay, and what we... Wait a second, wait a second. There are chests in here. I will not leave them behind again. There we go. Okay, there's one. I'll go ahead and just kill this guy so he's not a problem while we take out the other chest. This will help us a little bit with crafting resources. There we go. Some chemicals, some leather. I, don't, I didn't really pay attention to what was in the other one. But uh, we need to get... Yeah, we need to locate the Templar leader. We need to find him. And apparently he is somewhere over this direction. Not too terribly far away. But far enough that uh, we need to run. And now where is he? There he is. Okay. Says tail the leader. It just has to be a tailing mission. Okay, come on. There we go. And they're actually speeding along fairly well. But I need to be careful. I do not want to get too close. At least they're not going so damn slow. 
Okay, come on. Which way is it going to turn? Okay. Need to be careful because we don't want to get too close to them. But we don't want to be too far away either. There we go. Oh! Hold up. There we go. Okay. Now he's on foot. Oh, come on. Seriously? How did I get detected? Who fucking detected me? There was nobody here. How the fuck did I get detected? The only person here was in the, the carriage that the Templar leader came on. So I don't understand what, how that screwed up. Uh, 1867 women died in an underground station. The inquest verdict was death from natural causes accelerated by suffocating atmosphere of the underground railway. Yes. In other words, she, to she choked on the smoke from the steam engines. Because, of course, they didn't have electric subways. They didn't have electric trains. All they had were steam locomotives at the time. <sighs> and when you have a steam locomotive with a boiler fueled by wood and f coal and fire that uh, is spewing up all this toxic smoke and you, you have it enclosed underground, it's no surprise that your passengers might be gasping for air when they come out the other end. Fellow conspirators soon enough. Okay. So we gotta tell this guy again. Luckily, we know it's not too far to where he uh, abandons his carriage. But yeah, I just gotta keep feathering. Just keep tapping the throttle here in order to uh, keep up with him without getting too close. Come on, there we go. Okay, right over here. Okay, stop. All right. Now let's take a look. What is it with them and dynamite? I've got to get back out of here quickly. Okay. Yes. Hijack the carriage. We no longer... No longer worries about... There we go. Oh, really? Well, we'll see about that. Time before explosion. Leave, reach a safe area in 80 sec, less than 80 seconds. Okay. Well, off we go then. Yeah, it didn't really matter about going into the restricted section now. Come on. Here we go. Off we go. Hey, can't that uh, fire engine put out the fire? But no, it, it's dynamite. It's it's not a good idea. Okay, come on. Come on. There we go. Out of the way, people. Out of the way. Come on. Oh, why, 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 why? There we go. Some kind of brawl broke out right there. I've got to get around. Come on, come on, come on. Zooming through traffic. Just kind of weaving around. And there's a fire on the bridge, too. Great. Come on. I don't think I'm going to get through in less than 80 seconds. There's just too much going on. Seriously. I am just having to try to weave mightily around everything here, and we are running out of time. We have less than half a minute. Come on, out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Come on, people. Come on. It's not too far away, but I have, like, no time. Okay. Now bail out, bail out, bail out. Bail out! Seriously. Okay. All right. We escaped before it exploded, luckily. We are safe. All right. Woo! And that's the end of Operation Drive for Lives. Okay. Well then. There is only one mission left. One at all. Why do they keep wanting to blow up Southwark? I don't understand that. That is the second time we have finished a mission here and ended up in Southwark. Okay. So, back to Buckingham Palace.
Yes, back to the palace for the last Victoria mission. We complete that, then we do World War One, and then we'll be done with this game until such time as more DLC is available. For one thing, there are like several missions, or several campaigns, I guess you could call them, that should be coming. Uh, we should be getting Jack the Ripper, and uh, according to, yeah, according to the back of the, the Gold Edition box, should be getting Jack the Ripper, The Last Mar Maharaja, at least those two. So, Jack the Ripper is obviously going to take place after the main events of this game because it takes, it's what, 20 years later? No, not 20 years. Uh, 10 years later, I think, maybe? I don't know. Maybe it is 20 years later. I don't remember. But we are going back down here. And we will be going up into the palace, if I can, from here. There, a way in there. Ah, uh, it gets me into the courtyard. Not exactly what I was looking for. I want that letter, and it should be somewhere around here. I just don't know exactly where. 